Hello, it's Callum and welcome to this painting tutorial uh, continuing on with the Liberator and today we're doing the metallics so we are going to start with a base coat of lead belcher from the Citadel paint range uh, two thin coats to get this to a nice smooth consistency um, basically going over bits like the hammer there's the actual hammer the hammer on the shield and uh, touching up any of the other metallic areas uh, on the miniature so now that base coat's been applied, um, it's time to go in with a non-oil wash. Uh, now you can see I start by going into the recesses just to really make sure that those areas are accentuated. Uh, you know, really draw the paint into the recesses um, and then build out from there. Like I, I, it ends up going over the whole thing, but I, want, I always want to make sure it's in the areas it should be first. Um, and this is done across the, across the miniature, including the tabard at the bottom there. And now that's been done, it's time for a quick dry brush with Iron Breaker. So don't forget to wipe the paint off sufficiently and uh, basically hit all the metallic areas with a nice light dry brush just to bring that shine back and take away the dulling effect of non-oil. And lastly, once that step has been done and you've got that shine back in the metallics, it's time to hit it up with a highlight of a Rune Fang Steel, also from the Citadel paint range. And uh, with this model, there's loads of nice, strong edges to edge highlight, uh, particularly on the hammer. Um, and it really adds that extra level of, um, of realism, that extra dimension to the miniature. Um, so, but the only thing I will say is be careful on the tabard not to go too crazy. It really is just a, a, a really light edge highlight. And there you have it, that is the miniature finished, well, the miniature's metallics finished. Um, next time I'll be going over the scrolls, so you can see on the back there the big scroll and the one on the shield, and we'll be building those up together. Um, I hope you've enjoyed the series so far. If you want to see more, uh, then like and subscribe and comment below. Let me know what you think. As you can see, we're making some pretty good progress on this guy, and uh, we aren't too far from finishing him off. So hopefully I'll see you guys in the next one.